why am I blowing the shofar? It is nowhere near the Jewish New Year, Rosh Hashanah. I'm blowing it because in this week's Torah portion, the shofar is mentioned, and it's a very famous verse regarding the shofar, which is actually inscribed on the Liberty Bell in Philadelphia. Leviticus, Vayikra, chapter 25, verse 10. It says, Ukratem dror ba'aretz l'chol yoshveh. You shall proclaim liberty throughout the land to all its inhabitants thereof. Actually, I don't think the Hebrew says thereof. I don't even know what that means. But in any case, what it says is proclaim liberty throughout the land. That verse is inscribed on the Liberty Bell. A very beautiful verse. And the Sifri, one of the rabbinic commentaries from pre mishnaic over a thousand years old, uh, 2000 years old, actually tells us that shofar always is an indication of freedom. On the Jubilee year, when it's blown, it shows freedom for slaves, land returning to its original owners, uh, freedom to live wherever you want, etc. But even the shofar that we blow on Rosh Hashanah is also about freedom. What is it about? It's about freedom from sin, freedom from our past, freedom from things that burden us down, uh, freedom from uh, uncontrollable, uh, well, actually controllable lusts and so on and so forth. It's about freedom of will. Because in Judaism, one of the most central ideas of the entire Torah is that the human being has freedom of will. And we remind ourselves of that very often. One of the times we remind ourselves of it is in this week's Torah portion or on Rosh Hashanah when we blow the shofar, remind ourselves of the freedom that we actually are free people. And even though we have been slaves many times, we are always called B'nai Chorin, which means free, because intrinsically the human being has freedom of will, that human being is free. If you're enslaved to something, even if that thing is something within yourself, maybe an addiction, maybe a desire that you cannot control, maybe anger, etc., etc., that's slavery. And what we hope for is to free ourselves from all types of slavery and to be free of someone else controlling me or something within me which is negative controlling me. So proclaim freedom, liberty throughout the land to all its inhabitants. It was not a bell that was ringing. It was a shofar. And the origin is in this week's Torah portion. This is Mordechai Becha with the Gateways Parish Vlog.